Hi, uh, and welcome to Powered by Science. Uh, I'm Josh, I'm 23 years old. Um, I'm a natural bodybuilder, have been training for around seven to eight years, uh, and I'm looking to compete in around about a year's time. Uh, I know a year's a long time away uh, to start prep as such, um, so what I want to do, I want to showcase the difference between off-season and on-season. Um, so at the moment I'm currently in off-season, I'm currently living in Australia, um, and uh, I will be, like I said, competing in next year, around June, July. Uh, so my actual prep will be starting around January. So um, I want to take you through the difference between off-seasons uh, and my on-season, um, whether that will be training splits, um, macronutrients, how my nutrition changes, uh, when I put cardio in, how much cardio I do, etc. Uh, so yeah, I'm in off-season at the moment. Uh, I just basically want to showcase how flexible um, and how sustainable my diet is throughout uh, the whole time through off season into my prep. Uh, so yeah, uh, I will be returning to the UK in December. Uh, so things will probably change around that sort of time. Um, so yeah, looking forward to getting back. Uh, and basically just want to showcase uh, from now uh, how my off season looks, uh, how I'm training, uh, and just the difference between off season and on season. Right, so like I said, I've been training for around seven to eight years. Uh, I basically want to highlight through uh, this channel of some of the correct ways or some of the ways that have worked for myself and some of the ways that haven't worked necessarily. Maybe you can put yourself into the same categories that I have uh, and so we can basically run through things of how I'm doing things now, uh, what's working for me and what has been working for me for, me for the past four to five, maybe six years now. Uh, at the moment, uh, I'm a firm believer in uh, diet flexibility and diet sustainability. Um, so basically you want to showcase that maybe a little bit more as well, help you guys understand it a lot better than some people uh, are sort of reading amongst the internet through videos, etc. Uh, so basically, hopefully uh, you guys will gain a little bit more out of it uh, and hopefully understand that you don't need to be eating the same thing on a day-to-day -day basis to look the way you want to. Um, so this is what uh, this channel will hopefully um, help you out with uh, along the way. Right, so what you can expect throughout this channel uh, is basically a day-to-day -day living uh, of how I do things, um, how I train, how I eat, um, how, how many times I train a week, um, etc. Uh, so yeah, basically this is what you do expect as well. Um, I do work nine to five. I'm a 9 to 5 job so you can see how I fit my training in and how I fit my eating in as well. Uh, I'm also a coach so I do have a few uh, clients that I have to sort of uh, manipulate into my 9 to 5 job as well. Uh, you'll be sort of seeing the journey uh, that they will be going on as well um, onto stage uh, as one of them is competing around late September so uh, we'll be showcasing that as well. Uh, so yeah also along the way just basically want to give you some knowledge, uh, maybe some handy hints. Uh, maybe some just some fun facts as well of um, how you can sort of change, um, maybe implement a few things that will help you uh, just create a flexible and sustainable way of living, living, eating, and training. Uh, just because um, you just got, you've got to enjoy what you do at the end of the day. So hopefully, um, I'll give you a, lo a little bit of knowledge as well um, to uh, help you through with that. Right, guys. So it's now up to you. Uh, please like, subscribe, follow. Uh, comment etc um, and just follow the journey uh, I know it's another one of these generic journey things but uh, maybe you'll learn something different from me uh, and so hit them buttons um, I'll be sure to like comment subscribe back and hopefully we'll see you on the next video